Well, just give me your thoughts uh, on, on where you went and the team you're going to and uh, the phone call and, and all that. Uh, you know, it feels crazy. You know, uh, never really talked to Arizona. You know, uh, I, I think we, we said something to each other maybe at the combine. But, uh, I mean, I'm not, I'm not really sure. There's so many of them. Uh, so we talked, you know, I mean, when we talked on the phone, like uh, a couple of picks before I was actually picked, you know, uh, I was, I was just losing my mind, you know. It's, it's, it's Arizona, you know. I got Pat out there, and uh, you know I had early down there, so it was like, you know, it was, it was pretty surreal. I'm, I'm, I'm actually, you know, being able to play with these guys again. So. And so you're just sitting on the couch when they called? Yeah, you there with my family. Everybody's got the cameras out, losing their mind. <laughs> <laughs> They're more nervous than I was. How, how many tears? <laughs> Too many. To me, te- tears of joy, though. Oh yeah, definitely. You know, everybody just tied on me. You know, and they know how, how, how hard I worked to get to this spot. You know, and uh, they just had you for me. And I'm just, I'm glad I could just share that, you know, experience with my family. What was your reaction when you found out Tyron Matthew was also drafted by the Cardinals? I was, it was crazy. You know, it was me, me in between his three years. You know, he was a boy. You know, and uh, I'm just glad. You know, you know you. He was able you know, to get that opportunity. You know, he spent through so much, you know, so much adversity, you know, so many people, you know, doubting, uh, doubting him. You know, I, I know he's going to turn heads when he gets to the league. What do you think it means now that he has a family, a support system on that team with you, Patrick Peterson, and, and other guys there that he can count on to kind of keep him on the, the straight and narrow? I think it's going to be big for him. You know, he's a uh, you know, uh, – you know, he's pretty self motivated, but it definitely won't hurt to have guys like us, you know, on the team to be able, you know, to, you know, to be on his side and, you know, just, you know, help support him throughout this process. Kevin, how do you feel today making the trip in the last couple of years as being a guy that really hadn't really earned his name at L S U to being a guy now who is a second round draft pick in the NFL draft? I it's crazy. You know, it's uh that works in serious ways, you know. Yeah. Uh, you know, we uh, when I got up here, you know, I, when I got to LSU, I thought, you know, I was a great player, and that I was obviously humbled when I first got to yeah, my freshman year. You know, I had some guys in front of me that was amazing. You know, with Perry Riley and Kevin Shepard, and you know, I, I just had I, I had to really learn football. And when I really got, you know, my feet wet, when I really got the experience in me, I got my confidence up. You know, I, I started playing like, you know, I know I could play. And, and it's just everybody just started to notice, you know, I finally lived up to my potential. You know, it's, I'm just I'm just very blessed to be in this position. You know, uh, uh, you know, I've, I've grew up with a, a lot of great players. You know, being from the place where, where I'm at, you know, Atlanta, they they breed a lot of you know different you know athletes, some of the best athletes in the country. You know, and for me, you know, to be, you know, to, to come out of that and just, you know, uh, be here right now, it's, it's amazing.